The Tyrannosaurus Rex, undoubtedly the crown king of predatory dinosauria. Research has come so far in documenting and speculating on their appearance, behavior, and movement, based on some very sound scientific methods. However, I do have a problem with how they're usually presented. Now, I'm not a paleontologist or a scientist by any stretch, so consider this rant as the imaginings of a bored animator. Toy manufacturers are always criticized for making them in an upright pose, but that's only because building them in the accepted correct way will guarantee that they tip over forward. The ones that aren't upright will usually exaggerate the size of the feet and the placement of the legs for better balance. Consider that most all T-Rex fossil displays have a solid prop under the ribcage, most probably because they'll fall forward without it. I mean, even peacocks with all that rear counterweight hardly ever place their relatively tiny heads forward past their center of gravity. Birds hold their heads forward only to feed or contribute to forward momentum while in motion and always cock their heads back to recenter their balance. So why aren't they ever interpreted as walking more like chickens or other birds? Because that would make them look too goofy? Or have we romanticized their dynamics too much? I mean, what, the T-Rex is too cool when it starts to walk physics just looks the other way? So it's probable that they walk and stand more like this. I know, not as cool, huh? But hey, <laughs> could be true.